Welcome inside the San Jose Convention Center, everybody. My name is Mike Petralia. This is the headquarters of the Carolina Panthers as they make their final preparations for Super Bowl 50 on Sunday at Levi's Stadium just down the road in Santa Clara against the Denver Broncos. The big star of the day here on Thursday, the final day of media availability, none other than Snoop Dogg. He made his greetings with Peyton Manning in a fist pound over in Santa Clara earlier on Thursday morning, and then he made his greetings and acquaintances with Aqib Tlaib, who spent about three or four minutes with him, telling him that he was his idol, his main man growing up. As far as Carolina Panthers, uh, Snoop Dogg made his way over to Carolina linebacker Luke Keekley and called him the best linebacker in the game. On to the game itself and the news of the day for the Carolina Panthers continues to be the health of linebacker Thomas Davis. He again said here on Thursday that he would be ready. He and his broken right forearm that was surgically repaired last week. He should be a go for the game. He will obviously be playing with a protective brace on that right forearm. For the Denver Broncos, they're relatively healthy. They should be ready to go. Peyton Manning says he'll just have to be sure to take care of the ball against a defense that is one of the most active in the National Football League. As far as the Carolina Panthers are concerned, a key member of that defense, of course, the aforementioned Luke Keekley, who Snoop, Snoop Dogg called the best linebacker in the game. He said, you cannot be fooled by Peyton Manning's calls at the line of scrimmage. You have to get into your defense and stick with it. Keekley also on the subject of whether or not he might be the best uh, player to ever come out of the Boston College football program said, it's a great compliment, but really when you come to think of it, it's Doug Flutie who has the statue outside Alumni Stadium. Again, follow on, uh, coverage on, of Super Bowl 50 on weei.com, the It Is What It Is blog. We'll have complete coverage from now up until and through Super Bowl 50. In San Jose, Mike Petralia, weei.com.